if you had enough of proving your humanity to Google and acting as their image analyzer and you want a better solution for at least your website so that your website visitors can have a better experience, then here is a solution. Meet Cloudflare Turnstile, which promises to have a frustration-free and a captcha-free experience for our website visitors. So let's find out if it is true or not. first step is to add our WordPress website in Cloudflare. So let's go ahead and see how we can do that. So here we are in our Cloudflare account. We have created a free account and right from our dashboard, we can see an option for turnstile, which is in beta version right now. Let's click on this. And now we can see an option to add a site to get started. So let's go ahead and add a site. So first we need to give a site name. So let's do that. And then we will enter the domain. So as soon as you click on this option, it will show you all the websites that are already added in your Cloudflare account. So if your website is already added, so you can select the site from here or you can simply type in the URL. So we are going to enter our domain here and then click on add custom domain. And below that we have widget mode. So we can choose how we want this turnstile captcha to work. Either it is managed where Cloudflare might give an option to the visitor to click on the checkbox. And after that, we have non-interactive. And as the name suggests, it's a non-interactive captcha where the user will see the progress while the browser challenge is in run. And the third one is invisible, which works completely without any interaction of user. So if you want a completely invisible solution, you can go with the last one. But let's see how the second one goes. Let's click on create. And now we have successfully added our site. We have our site key and secret key option here, which we need to add on our WordPress website. So let's dive in in our WordPress backend and see how we can add this. So we come back here in our WordPress backend and from here we go to plugins and then click on add new. And in the search term, we will type in turnstile. And this is the simple Cloudflare turnstile plugin that we need to use. So let's click on install and then click on activate. All right, so now we need to enter our site key and secret key here. So let me just click on copy from here and then paste the key. Same goes with the secret key. We will paste it here. And after that, we have some general settings here. So we can choose the theme, either light or dark. So I'll choose dark here. And language, we will keep it on auto detect. Otherwise, you can choose the language from the list here. After that, we have appearance mode. So here it says always or interaction only. So let's choose always here. You can also choose interaction only. So this is going to only show once there is any interaction happens. So I'll keep it on always. After that, we have disable submit buttons. So this is the option. If we enable this, the user won't be able to click on the submit button until the turnstile challenge is completed. So we can turn it on from here. And below this, we have custom error message. So if there is any error, you can type in your custom message here. So I will leave it as it is. And now comes the important part where we want to enable this. So we want this on WordPress login, registration, password reset and comment and then we just click on save changes all right so here we can see almost done we can verify our api keys and our integration from here so let's say we click on test response it says success so it means we have successfully configured cloudflare turnstile in our wordpress website Let's open our blog post in an incognito window. Let's scroll down to the comment section. And as soon as we landed on the comment section, we saw we have a success message. So we don't have to solve any image puzzle or do any maths. It's done automatically. We can even get rid of this box if we change the settings in our Cloudflare. And if you go ahead and open our WordPress backend, we can see we also have the Cloudflare turnstile active here as well. 
So now we just need to fill up the details and the captcha will be done automatically. So this is how we can use Cloudflare Turnstile captcha for our WordPress website. If you like this video, then make sure you give it a like. And if you want to track user experience on your website and see how your website visitors are interacting with your website, check out this video right here, how you can track different events on your WordPress website using the plus add-ons for Gutenberg and Google Analytics 4. And to watch more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. So that's it for this video and I'll see you in the next one.